It's my birthday. I know what you're going to say. Drew, you never told us how old you are. Well, I'm 25. Hey, hey. I know. I know. 25 is a little, it's a little young. You know what I'm saying? For you? You feel me? I still feel young, man. Hell no. Yeah, 25 Damn. is still young, man. Like, you know what I'm saying? I still feel like, even though it's a quarter of the way, well, go ahead and say it. You're not going to say it? So, yeah, right. Mother. So you guys want to know how to get the view distance like this. All you need is the skate native menu, and I'm going to show you guys how to get that in a second. But here's what it looks like. Here we go. I'm gonna show you how to get it, guys. All right, so first things first, you're gonna wanna join the modding Discord, which is in the description below, along with my Discord, if you want some saves, like the one that I'm using in the video right now. So when you're in the modding Discord and you verify, you're gonna wanna go to releases, and then go to downloads, and then you're gonna wanna click this link right here. Now, when you click this link, this page will show up. Don't get alarmed. You're only gonna get one thing off this full page right here. Right here, Skate 3 Native Menu. This is the password for it right here. I'm gonna go to Mediafire, RPCS3 folder, and then Skate 3 Native Menu. Click Download. You don't have to do any ads or anything. It's a straight download. Once you have it downloaded, you're gonna to wanna to click on it, and then it's gonna bring up this menu right here, this password thing. If you don't know the password, it's right here, S3NM, put that in, S3NM, click OK, and then now all you have to do is extract two. I'm gonna put it to my hard drive, I already put it in, here it is right here. All you gotta do is click OK, and then now you have the native menu. Now in order to use this menu, I noticed that uh, sometimes your computer will automatically remove the app if it doesn't trust it. So I'm going to show you how to prevent that from happening. You want to open up Windows Security, go in your settings, and then go to Windows Security and then hit open Windows Security. Once you're in this window, go down to manage settings under virus and threat protection. Then scroll down to the bottom and click add or remove exclusion. Once you're about to add an exclusion, I already added mine. All you have to do is click on add an exclusion, click file, click on the skate three native menu folder, and then click on skate three native menu, and then click open. After you do that, you're good to go. Now, in order to open the menu, you're going to double click on the Skate 3 native menu and this window will pop up right here. Credits to all the modders and it tells you how to use it. Before you just like open it and just start playing with it, it'll wait for the Skate 3 window to be scanned and then it's gonna attach. And then eventually you're gonna see this right here. That means it's ready to go. So now, ready to start modding. All you have to do to open this menu up is hold R3 and then left down on D-pad and it'll pop it up. There's a bunch of things you can do with this table. Here's the settings that I always turn on. No air timer. That means like I could be in the air for as long as I want and then no pedestrians or traffic. That's for like career mode. When you're on career mode, you don't want to see any pedestrians or traffic. Online speed on. This is like to get the the low latency for your tricks. No speed caps. You ever do like a backwards man and then get instantly reset? Well, now you don't get instantly reset. And then the visual mods. Clean replays. It just turns off the HUD. Mute environment on. This turns off like all the like background noise and it's just your board. And then the brightness at negative five because on the RPCS3 version of Skate 3, everything is like bright as hell. Here's the draw distance control right here. I'm about to show you right now. Boom. You see that? My game looks mad weird right now because I have the Z call off because I always use the high FPS mode. I hope you like this video. Leave a comment, subscribe, and if you need any help, you can join my Discord below and I'll guide you through or someone else will. Till next time, guys, it's Drew the King. You already know. I, I gang gang. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.